who it is. It's Tino Rodriguez with another supplement review. This time we're reviewing Mesomorph by APS. And here's the test producer that came both free. I'm getting no, none of those problems, so I probably won't even need this. But let's go ahead and get down to the review. Actually, I should probably tell you what's in this first. Uh, we got a 6500 complex blend, uh, beta alanine, citrulline, uh, arginine. Then we have a cell volumizing complex, which basically has three different types of creatine, malate, nitrate, phosphate, and agmatine sulfate. Then we have the Neuromorph Stimulant Matrix, 1,870 milligrams, which consists of caffeine, gluco, and a word that I can't pronounce, um, something that looks like a steroid. It's not, though. 3,7-dihydro, 3,7-dimethyl, 1-H-purine, 2,6-dione. That sounds like a steroid. Nerogen and Goronaburn. It says to take this one scoop, don't need any more than one scoop, and eight to ten ounces of water. I'm going to pour my water. Oh yeah, product placement. Take our full scoop. This powder looks really weird. The flavor is Rocket Pop. It looks like a, if you could see that, it looks like a popsicle. And the powder even looks like that. It's like red, white, and blue. It looks like sprinkles. Let's go. Put a whole scoop. They say one whole scoop has 4,000 milligrams of beta alanine. So, should give you a pretty good tingle. I'm all about that tingle. Let's go. Snap that on. Give it a good shake. on this as far as the flavor goes. Some people said it was really good, some people said they didn't like it, so I'll drink just about anything because flavor doesn't really matter as long as it gives me them damn gains, man. Anything for the gains. Let's go. Looks, looks like it mixed pretty well. Give it a taste. That is strong. That is that is strong. It's got like a like a vodka aftertaste. Not digging that. Very very chemically uh, tasting. Uh, I don't think I like that. Taste is not very pleasant. This is one of those that you just better. You know what? I'm not even gonna switch it around anymore. Fuck this. I'm just gonna drink it down. I'm just gonna down. Down it! Ah, it doesn't end!
should have been a disclaimer. That is not very pleasant. Uh, and I had cold water too, so I mean, don't put room temperature water or hot water, because that would just be fucking disastrous. So, taste is not very good. Mixability was pretty, pretty good. Uh, the taste actually reminds me of uh, BSN um, Hyper FX. It has a very, I don't know, very strong, bitter taste. Uh, uh, it might be just from all the ingredients in it. The only thing I can, I can think that would make it taste like that, other than the, just the flavor itself, is the, the neuro matrix. Might be playing a role into that. So overall, Taste on a scale of 1 to 10. Uh, I mean, it's bad, but it's not to where I won't drink it. Like, it's 25 servings. Let me just get the lid here. It's 25 servings. Um, you only have to take one scoop. So, it's not undrinkable, but it's not good by any means. So, uh, I'll... I'll give it a five. It's it's doable. Anything lower than five is borderline. Bro, I'm gonna fucking throw up on myself. Uh, other than that, I'm gonna go ahead and do a workout. Um, should be training back, shoulders, and triceps. Really strange ass split because my workouts this week were a little bit off. So just kind of have to make up everything. And it says to wait about 40, 45 minutes before you work out. Give it a go. Um, as of right now, starting to feel a, a little bit of the beta alanine already, which is good. I like that. Um, I don't think my heart is racing. It might just be the placebo effect, but we'll go ahead and get a good workout in and see how it goes. Thanks.